Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you what you can all do in your event page. So we created this event a couple of minutes ago and uh, all we have to do is just one person responded. I created this event. It's gonna happen in uh, Brooklyn, Slovakia. Duration is four hours and it's public event. So anyone can see it, anyone can attend it. There are no prices. Uh, there are no prices for tickets and there is no merchandise to be sold on the place. So what can we else do? We can boost the event, for example. You can accept it. Uh, description, blah, blah, blah. It's just budget for two, uh, two, dollar, uh, two euros. It's your ad will run for one day. Uh, accounts reached around 875 to 2.5k total amount so beneficiary name uh, payer name and all of this you can go up to 500 which they will reach 66.6k of people minimum that's what they guarantee you pretty nice but yeah if you are doing just something so the close friends uh, can join it's perfect so that's a boost event option. Then we can invite people. You can invite your followers, events you attended, events you hosted, or people from the group. So at the moment, there is no group underneath uh, my page. So uh, uh, that's not an option. Same goes with uh, events I attended or events I hosted. But uh, we can also switch uh, to we can switch to your personal profile uh, to personal profile but uh, but uh, I don't have so many people in there because I created just in the sake of this tutorial so yep but you get it you just invite people 500 is the top number and that's all you should know about then uh, 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 we have uh, edit of the option for the event. These are those are the details that I entered once I created this uh, event. I don't really want to go around those changes, but the main one is you can either share it through uh, through link or share to feed, or there are the three dots. And uh, if you made a mistake. And you want to cancel the event you can click on cancel the event on the three dots as you can see in here you can notification settings duplicate yada 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 all of those are not that mandatory and you probably won't be looking for them but there is a chance you will need to cancel the event and this is the option this is the way so delete event and then confirm once you delete it no one gets any heads up so uh, so yeah just like that if you cancel it there will be a personalized message that uh, tutorial test was deleted or was cancelled or rescheduled so that's about it guys thanks for watching and see you in the next one have a great day and goodbye